when when I go to the interview and when I'm nervous, I cannot speak English. Okay. Yeah. But you're speaking English now, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, a little bit nervous. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back to Falang Day. My name is Sunny Burns and we're searching for someone to speak English for five minutes for 1,000 wow. baht. So let's get straight to action and welcome today's guest. Hello. Sorry, Kaf. What's your name? My name is Mink. Mink, like the animal? Yeah, I just have to. Okay. Yeah. So what brings you here today? I, I want to ask you for an advice mm -hmm. because I want to be a crab and crew. Wow. You want to be a crab and crew, okay. Yeah, but I'm not success. I'm not success. I'm not success. My Cub. So today the topic is job interviews, okay? So, Stopwatch, are you ready? So I want you to speak English for five minutes with no dead air. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, three. Two, one. Okay, so normally at the cabin crew interviews, the first thing is to introduce yourself. So I want you to please introduce yourself. Okay, hello everyone. My name is Supisala Tho Pai Si. Uh, my name is Ying Ming, or you can call me Ying Ming. Now I'm 24 years old. I'm graduate from Gatsisat University, Faculty of Humanity. Okay, and why do you want to be cabin crew? Uh, why I want to be traveling crew because I love traveling. Mm -hmm. I have a service mind and I have good communication skill. Okay, and yeah. what is a service mind? Service mind is like um, I don't know. <laughs> don't know what a service mind is. Okay, it's like service mind, like something like that. I'll okay. just please people or something. <laughs> I don't know. My <laughs> <laughs> life, my life. So, um, what do you think your weakness is and your strengths are? My weakness? Mm, now I think my weakness is about my English skill. Um, about my strength. I'm, I'm a kind people, I'm friendly people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I want to. Do that. Uh, take care of people, okay. like that. All yeah. Right, good. Okay. And tell me about your experience when you went to a cabin group interview before. Experience about. Oh uh, it's good. I think uh, sometimes we have so much fun, but I feel like I'm excited mm -hmm. all the time. A, a little bit nervous, and so uh, it's not. I, I did it not good, okay. like that, yeah. And another question they ask at Cabin Crew interviews is where do you see yourself in five years time? Five years time? Mm, I think I'm gonna successful in... <laughs> I don't know, oh my god. <laughs> They ask questions like this all the time to be cabin crew. Yeah. Yeah, you have to know now. Okay. <laughs> it's yeah, that, important. That's I don't know, so i not succeed. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So what do you think the biggest difference is between Thai people, Chinese people, and even Westerners? A lot. <laughs> okay, because yeah. they ask this all the time in interviews as well. Yeah, so I have to say in a good way, right? Right, yeah. <laughs> uh, Actually, uh, many uh, many culture have different thing and they. How can I say? <laughs> it's it's both good, yeah. And I think um, Chinese is. I I think it's about culture that uh, they eat and they. Like Bolao and Thai or Just something. Say they eat different. <gasps> yeah, uh -huh. different ways. So we have to understand how different the culture and admit it and happy with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I and think. for the Thais, for the Thais, how is Thai different from the Chinese? Mm, we, I think, we're more polite. Mm -hmm. 
yeah, and not speak only loud like uh -huh. Chinese people. Okay. Yeah. And what about the phalang? I have seen. <laughs> so, um, but in terms of the culture, do you think Western culture is quite different from Thai culture? Yeah, too much. How? Like gender. Oh no, gender. it's not gender. It's, it's not like that. It's like how. <laughs> it's like they ask we, this question all the time. Act uh huh. To each other, like be, be, uh, between girl and boy. Okay. Yeah, in Thai, it's more, you cannot touch. You cannot like girl mm -hmm. something like that. But in Western, we can touch. We Show can, affection. Can, yeah. Show affection. Like that. Yeah. Okay. But you know, some Falang countries you can't show affection as well. Yeah? Yeah, it just depends on the um, country, I think. But in Thailand, I see tomboys with their D girlfriend all the time. It's, it's girl. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Tomboy is girl. Okay, I get it. All right. Oh, time's up. Oh my god! Oh. Wow. I did it. <laughs> you did it. You did it. Time's up. So, how do you feel that you went today with your English? Mm, I think it's. Quiet, okay, baby. Uh -huh. So <laughs> I think for you, your personality is really like Nara. But, <laughs> but to be cabin crew, you need to be more confident and yeah. more strong in your answers. Because at the end of the day, so many Thai girls want to be cabin crew. Yes. And sometimes being cabin crew is a bit like auditioning for Asia's Next Top Model. <laughs> so yes. you have to prepare what you're going to say. Yeah. So I noticed when I asked you, why do you want to be cabin crew? You said you love traveling, you have good communication skills yeah. and service mind. Yeah. Then I asked you, what is a service mind? <laughs> it may help, <laughs> right? Mm. But I feel when I train girls for yeah. job interviews like this, a lot of the time they say service mind. The correct way to say it is service minded attitude. Okay? Oh. But still, nah, saying service minded is very cliche. Cliche? Cliche. Oh. It's like something that people use and say all the time. So oh. a lot of Thai girls, when they be cabin crew, I have good service mind, I have good communication, and I love traveling. Oh, I see. So to be yeah. cabin crew, they want someone who can work. They don't want to give someone a free holiday. <gasps> so I think the best way to say it is say things like, oh, I want to be cabin crew because I believe my personality is suitable for this job. Uh -huh. I have experience. It's important to show the interviewer you have experience. Plus you understand what the job is all about. And I like it when people say, I'm a good listener. I understand the needs and wants of the customer. I think that's important. To be cabin crew, you have to be a good listener. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So today, do you think you deserve 1,000 baht or not? Yes! Are you sure? Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Okay then. Yeah. Well, you win 1,000 baht. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, <laughs> good luck with your um, cabin crew dream. But it's important to be more like Tliam Jai. Be more okay. prepared. Be yeah. more prepared. And be more strong with your answers. Okay? okay. All right, don't give up. Okay? Yeah. All right. So, that's all that we have time for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to join our show, send us a message on our Facebook page. I'll see you soon. Cop and cup. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. <laughs>